Um, for all of you that are wondering what I record um, my screen with, well, what I'm going to start recording my screen with, um, I'll just show you um, a YouTube clip now. So, um, this is coming up. Watching funny cats earlier. Uh, my channel. So what you, you can do if you don't wanna like watch this video. Well, you're watching it now anyway. So. Do 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 do. Wow, it's taking forever. So I'll show you here. Sit back and. End <laughs> Sabi uh, Operation Android here, and in this video, I will be showing you how to get an iOS 7 through 8.0.2 screen recorder on your iOS device named Shu. Now, the reason I say 8.0.2 is because in the upcoming release of iOS 8.1, you will be unable to do the day trick due to Apple's patching of it. So, if you want to continue to get amazing applications like emulators and screen recorders, do not update to 8.1 because you will be unable to do so. Do not update. But with that being said, let's begin. Alright, getting the shoe screen recorder is very simple and to do it, all you have to do is open Safari and in the URL type in emuforios.net. And now this will take you to a web page where you'll be able to download an additional application which is called the emu for ios store and within that application we can get the shoe screen recorder so once the page loads you can read there that it says that the yeah. really quick is required so go ahead and click install hit install again and now quickly head to your settings then scroll down to general, date and time, turn off set automatically, and scroll your date back at least 24 hours. You can do more just to play it safe. However, as you can see, our emu for iOS store is now there, and our first application there is the shoe screen recorder and broadcaster. So go ahead and click on that, hit install, hit install again, and it will begin to install the application. And then once the application is finished installing, open it one time and then you can head back into your settings and turn on, turn on set automatically and then go back to the application. You will have to do this each time your iOS device turns off. Now, using the shoe screen recorder does require sign up. So by clicking on the bottom, you can enter a username and email and a password and it works very similar to twitch.com. And that's because this also works as a broadcasting service besides just recording your screen. Pretty much from here, you just log in. Um, pretty much every time you your device turns off, you've got to do it again. Um, so I would kind of keep it on charge when it's running low. Um, and that's about it. And there's lots of options, like if you want to record portrait, landscape, home button to the left, home button to the right. Because I was doing a let's play and I ended up filming it upside down. And I had to do it all over again. So thanks for watching. And there will probably be another Minecraft video up tomorrow maybe. Thanks for watching. Peace.